good morning. So I've just started out on my adventure for the day. I'm in the Brecon Beacons and I'm doing the Brecon Beacons Horseshoe, or the Penny Fan Horseshoe, I'm not sure I've seen it called both. Um, so I'll be heading up Penny Fan and then summiting Penny Fan, Corn Dew, Cribbin and Fanny Big and then back down. I've actually wanted to do this probably since like the start of this year so it's December and I'm finally getting around to it. If you watched my last video that I posted, which was my last solo hike of the Glitters, you will know that I got myself completely lost and um, it was a bit of a failure. So this time, um, I've plotted my own route on OS Maps. Pretty happy with it, got to grips with it. But, like I've plotted an actual path, but there isn't a path. It's just, uh, it's just this. It's just um, boggy, lumpy ground which is really difficult to walk on, especially when you don't know where the holes are. Um, so it just goes to show, even when you plot your own route, you're never entirely sure what the path is gonna look like, but um, thankfully I know I'm on the right path, so once I get up here, uh, I should have more of a level ground to walk on um, and more of an actual obvious path rather than this. Well, I made it. I'm up on the top of the ridge. The only thing about this route is that once you're up on the ridge line, you're just completely exposed, so you've got no cover from the wind or the cold, so I'm layering up because I'm getting a bit chilly and I need some better gloves on as well. Toasty! Oh, so much nicer. Oh my god, it's snowing! It's actually snowing! I underestimated how hard this would be. Thinking it was flat along the top. It is flat. But the winds are so strong that just kind of battling against them. Fingers are freezing. Two down, two to go. Okay, before the cloud comes in again, summit so number three, Cribbin. Um, it is the steepest. doesn't even do it justice on here, you can't tell, but it's just, it is literally just straight up and I'm petrified. So 
I'm gonna take a little break here, have a bit of lunch, fuel up, get some calories and energy back inside me. <sighs> I've done it once before and I'm fitter now, but yeah. Cribbing. <laughs> Made it. Funny big. Fourth summit. I'm dead. I'm so dead. dead but very happy awesome up here as well just just ugh, the views i'm finished four summits um corn do penny fan cribbin and fanny big I loved that. That was such an awesome day, despite some difficult weather patches, um, some really, really strong winds at the start, and then some very painful hail. But then uh, I have pretty much had like the whole break of vegans to myself. There's not been many people around, which has been nice. If anybody is wanting to do this route, I would definitely recommend it. I think it's a really nice hike. I think it'd be a little bit more enjoyable in the summer. Do you know what, there were just so many points where it would have been nice just to sit and enjoy the view for a little while, but it's just a bit too cold um, December to do that. But I would definitely recommend it. Awesome, awesome day. Well, I finished on 10 miles, five and a half hours, and 2,400 foot of elevation. I'm so tired. Um, thank you so much for watching. Um, I really hope you enjoyed it. And if you did enjoy it, please subscribe. I've been making these videos for a year now, um, and I just can't believe it's been a year. So thank you so much to anybody who has supported or followed or commented or liked or subscribed. Uh, it really does mean a lot, so thank you. And um, I really hope that I can inspire anybody to go out and do some of the walks that I do because I really enjoy them so I hope someone else can enjoy them too. Guess that's it. So 